Okay, this is looking pretty good. Um, uh, let's just kind of look at these objects one at a time. I'm going to isolate this. Um, I think this back here is looking a little weird. Do you have like a... Why does that look thick there? It must be just some display thing. Um, okay. Um, I think this kind of goes in maybe a little bit too much. Um, to B for soft select and hold down B and shrink that a bit, but you know, you could work on that shape a little bit more. Um, besides that, these are looking pretty good. Um, okay, and then uh, the shirt. Um, I think you could probably work on the shape of the collar a little bit, and it's a little uneven here. Hold down W, left mouse, symmetry, symmetry. Uh, pick these parts. Maybe kind of, you know, maybe try to make this a more sort of even size all the way around. Pick something else, I think. Yeah. It's an accident there, okay. Anyway, you could kind of adjust that. Um, something looks a little funny there, is that all right? I think that's all right. Um, the hands are looking kind of skinny and flat here. Um, one good trick if you want to just kind of push the shape out a little bit is if you um, select it and do Control F9, which is convert selection to verts, and, and then um, uh, yeah, the vertices are showing up strangely too. Hold W, left mouse, axis, normal. And just click and drag on this N. Why is that not working? Oh, it's just being sort of slow. I don't know why. But anyways, you can see it's getting fatter, uh, which I think is good for this. You know, it's just getting it more thickness. And maybe you want to kind of push out some of the points of the wrist as well. Like I might, you know, take out turn off symmetry for the moment. Yeah, there's something weird about the display here. X-ray active components. Oh, that's why. Okay. Shift right mouse click, delete edge. And then maybe, you know, scale this up. And then you can put some of those back in. And, you know, adjust it as you see fit, but Let's see how that looks in there. Well, you'd have to either adjust the sleeve or the that wrist. It probably doesn't even need to go back in that far, to be honest. Could probably take out at least this row. And then you just have to adjust this a bit. Actually, the whole thing maybe could slide out and just reset, double click here and reset to get it out of that center of the pivot. Actually, object mode might be better. And then I can just pull it out in the direction of the hand. Yeah, have a little wrist there. That could be good. Um, yeah, and shoes, um, okay, I thought there was, there's some, I don't know why these, there are these weird edges that are super close together here, um, which I probably wouldn't have, shift right mouse click, delete edge, and then maybe you can, well, 
at least this part of this. Just deselecting the rest of it, sh uh, shift right mouse click, slide edge tool, and just kind of even that out and do the same with this one. You know, maybe you want to, maybe another edge here if you want to kind of push these in a little bit. That's interesting. Oh, I had this selected by accident. Maybe a holding edge around the bottom here. I'm not sure why you need this edge. Is that really necessary? I don't think so. Shift right mouse click delete edge. Um, yeah, so I think you could shape these a little bit more. Maybe have like round out the top a little bit and that kind of stuff. But they're looking okay. Alright, yeah, this is looking pretty good.